<clears throat> I believe it's Damon. And I believe it is Joe. And I believe it's Damon, Damon and, and Joe. Joe. And guess where we're at today? The Grand Canyon. Canyon. Who knew that it was actually snowy here? I've been to the Grand Canyon once when I was 12. I was a little preteen. Let's not date you. It's been a few years, it's been my a friend. A few years. <laughs> I have never been here. I made her stop right outside. We're about to go see this view. Let's go. Okay. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Doesn't it look almost fake? This looks like a, a green screen. It looks like there's a wallpaper. My heart is beating Mine fast. Mine too. I think it's the altitude. Probably. <laughs> <laughs> this is like grand. <laughs> they just painted it and put it up. The contrast with the sky and the snow on the sides of the canyon and the layers. It's like chisel, 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 rock. Okay, Damon's afraid of things without ledges. Like, you bring us to the edge of Ecuadorian hills on a bus, no As ledge. I believe everyone should be. He's afraid. You get to the corner of a you, building. Though? I am afraid. Thank you. Period. There's no but to that. Like, I am afraid. Okay, everybody, if you don't know how to use a 360 camera, use your phone, use that ab core work. Why? Why to the right? Why to the left? Okay, no, honestly though, this is phenomenally crazy. Use caution near the edge. People die here failing from the edge. Why can't I read English today? High altitudes. I don't want to do anything near a sign that says people have died here. Just kidding, let's go over here. Why did you change your mind? <laughs> Get me back on the path! Get me back on the path! <laughs> Joe, that's where all the tourists are. Which we are too. Give me one word of what you think of the Grand Canyon right now. Like, damn, damn. So there are some travelers who disobey the signs and go down. Joe, actually, we should go down there. Come here, honey. Why are you going down there? Because this is the best spot for the view. Oh my god, you're insane. No, seriously, careful because honestly, you are on the edge of glory. All right. Okay, so. Damon Joe pulled up on the scene. We went to the visitor center. We needed to get some information because you can't come to a view like this and just be like, wow, nice. You can't. But I don't want to do that. Yeah, we don't do that. Don't that's do not that. our job. And we want to tell you like the good information that we found out from the visitor center. However, However, the problem is we feel this way. Maybe you do at home also. That when you pull up on a scene to a visitor center, a lot of times that information on the plaques is not like you know interesting. What? It's not. Edu I mean, it's educational. I have but to, a little like, too educational. Hold my anxiety here because I come in through the doors eager. The plaque reads. The isotopes of this geological layer are like. And I'm like, you know what? Let me walk to plaque two. You know what this is? This is the borometer because a lot of those signs, again, like, like I even took two. geology, gy like gy gynecology one time. <laughs> Guys, I took geology and I didn't like it, so I don't expect me to be super interested. No, but like I want history of the people here. I want to know exactly. who discovered it. On my plaque three, I'm like, really? I'm trying to go home. <laughs> I haven't even seen this yet. I'm feeling as dusty as these plaques. Like, and you know I, I don't like plaques. You know, I know you, you don't like who, plaques. Who flosses every day? <laughs> you do. I do. This is not just here, okay? This it's is not most just here. You know where else we Museums went? where? The Geology Museum. Geology Museum. No time like the present. <laughs> we got a few plaques here, Joe. Okay, this is interesting. See, I like the view. <clears throat> For example, for five million years, the Colorado River sliced layer after layer, cutting into the very foundation of the continent, the basin of rock. And that's exactly how fast it is for you to lose interest. Next! Okay, so when you come to a place like this, you're probably gonna realize like, oh snap, I'm not a scientist. I'm not a geologist, paleontologist, or archeologist. So I don't know what half of these words on these plaques mean, and I don't care because they don't apply to me. They're because not relatable. They're not relatable. So for us as travelers, we obviously wanna see this. This is a beautiful, beautiful wonder of the world. But what interests like me and Damon is like, who found it? How was this discovered? Where does the water come from? What's gonna happen if tourism develops into the cities? Is that gonna affect the natural state of the environment? Is there gonna be a skyscraper here one day? Maybe under our current president. Oh, oh shot fire! Boom, boom, boom! Okay, do you have anything else to say? This is your moment. Can we go see the Grand Canyon? I mean, are we there yet? I can't handle these jokes. I tried to like tandem on, okay, it's just like that. <laughs> Let me hear your best joke then. That's not how my charisma works. <laughs> He's been here before I haven't. I'm like, it's kind of embarrassing that me as an American citizen- You've never been here? Have never been here yet. French people, like pardoncers over there, Pardon. have been here. You know what I mean? So like, if you have something beautiful in your backyard, make a point to find it. To I mean, I'm gonna be it. real, it wasn't really in our backyard. I did drive eight hours to get here. <laughs> Wowzer! 
Wow. You know what? We're gonna do a 360 on a 360. Wow. Because that's what you need to see sometimes. Please make sure to comment below, have you been to the Grand Canyon? Do you want to go to the Grand Canyon? What does the Grand Canyon represent for you? You know what? And do you have fun facts? Because I'm all about my fun facts. What does it represent for you? For me? Wide open space. <laughs> Exploration. <laughs> Enjoy the view one last time, everybody. And we're out. Goodbye. Get the back. I get the foot. We're getting better.